Understanding, a man of few words. Hello everyone, today, we're going to explore a fascinating phrase in the English language, a man of few words. This phrase is commonly used, but what does it really mean? Let's dive into its meaning, usage, and origins to help you understand and use it effectively in English conversations. A man of few words is a phrase used to describe someone who speaks infrequently but says meaningful or important things when they do. It's often seen as a sign of thoughtfulness and wisdom. This phrase can be applied to any gender, despite the use of man in its traditional form. The origin of a man of few words can be traced back to early literary sources. It's a concept that values the quality of words over quantity, suggesting that a person who speaks less may actually have more to offer. Historically, such individuals were often respected for their thoughtful and deliberate approach to communication. In modern times, the phrase is used in various contexts. It might be employed to describe a person's character in a positive light or sometimes used to indicate that someone is shy or reserved. Understanding the context in which it's used is crucial for interpreting its meaning correctly. Let's look at some examples. 1. Despite being a man of few words, his speech was powerful and moving. 2. She appreciated her father's nature as a man of few words, finding his advice always concise and meaningful. This phrase also carries a cultural weight in different societies. In some cultures, being a man of few words is highly valued as it's associated with being reflective and wise. In others, it might be seen differently, perhaps less favorably, in more outgoing or talkative societies. A man of few words is a phrase rich in meaning and history. It reminds us that sometimes less is more, especially in communication. We hope this video has shed light on this interesting phrase and you can now use it confidently in your English conversations. Remember, in the world of language, every word counts. Happy learning.